All right, every small town has that one person everyone knows. Over in LaGrange, that's Pork Chop, and he's become an icon some locals say they couldn't live without. In a city where tourism is booming and trains are bustling, there's a voice that can be heard over just about anything. His real name is Donald Ray Ross, but everyone here knows him as Pork Chop. He's a kind of an institution. Just sets, he waves at people, talks to people. Um, you know, we, the community takes care of him. How long have you pork chop? Well, you can't put no gravy on me, baby. Ow! Lately, he carries a guitar, but make no mistake, he can't carry a tune. As a LaGrange native. You know, he's just he's just a uh, jovial fella. <laughs> oh, now I got to be Blake Shelton, too. If he's not rocking out in front of Mercantile on Main, this is my favorite going up. He's working odd jobs around town. He'll ask people, you got a job for me? You got a job for me? If you're uh, tearing a roof off or you're doing something intensive uh, that's very demanding, Pork chops your man. He admits he has a past. I was paying attention when I got my name. Quite literally serving pork chops to other inmates. Today, he serves his community in a different way. And we know what's going on and, in the alleys. And, and let Mr. John Black know what's going on and, in the alleys. And I show tell him. He's my security undercover. I can usually go to pork chop within 24 hours. We'll have a case resolved. Hey, my you can call him boisterous. And every so often I'll go out and say, Let's get a little quieter, pork chop. But even shop owners wouldn't have it any other way. He's just here to live out the rest of his days right here on this corner, and, and uh, I just hope he doesn't leave our town and go on tour. I'm blessed, and I can't ask for no more than that. In LaGrange. Take young man, take young man. Take it easy, sir. Have a nice day. Brooke Hash, WHAS 11 News on your side.